hello everyone and welcome to my youtube channel so in this video i'll be going through on how to set up your workspace for creating smart contract locally so every package we're going to use or software will be linked in the description so you can just head there and um, check the link out so let's move on now the first thing you need to do is open your browser and um you need to the requirements for it is installing Node.js, having Node.js installed, uh, having NPM, and um, also having Git. So I think uh, Node.js version 8 and above, um, NPM, I really don't know the version. Um, I think NPM, any version would be okay for NPM. So we have to we'll check, it out, check it out later on. And also having Git installed. So I believe um, everyone watching this video would have um, Git installed. So if you don't have git installed you can also head to the git uh website and uh, i think you installed it from there yeah so you, you need to have node.js installed yeah and what next we need to have visual studio code installed or you can also have sublime text installed because i have that here but i'm not going to use it so i'm coming i'm more of the vs code guy than the sublime text guy so you can use any of them so no difference and no um nothing uh, about it yeah so what the next thing you need to install is metamask yeah so we are going to be using metamask extension so this is actually firefox and i have it installed in my firefox so if you are using chrome you install it as an extension so you install it to please for i think this is for chrome this chrome web store yeah so you can see this is my metamask extension and it's requiring my password for me to be able to log in yeah so um that's all for that and what we next we need to do is install uh, what we create the boilerplate for our smart contract for us and that's called truffle so for us to install truffle you can go to documentation or guides but i would just like us to move to the tutorial so it it will be in the description truffle.suit.com so you can check the description yeah um so this is and this is the installation process so you can see here they said set up the development environment so you can see um you can read through from the beginning to but i will just be skipping some after some part yeah so node.js version 8 plus and uh lts plus lts anyone so if you're using the current version or the lts version and npm so you can see what i'm talking about so node.js and npm um and comes with node so it comes with node also using git i talked about this earlier on yeah so for us to install truffle this is the command we're going to use npm install dash g truffle so we are going to install truffle globally so i think you need to do that too so let me open my terminal so i have that installed already so after installing that for you to check if your um truffle is being installed you can just check just see truffle um version yeah so it's going to bring out the truffle version um so i think it's here too okay yeah so you can see the truffle version to check the version in our terminal um so we have to wait for that to, to bring out the version for us yeah this is it so we have truffle version 5.8 4.2 so that's thing too that's cool and um solidity version 0.5.16 so this solidity version um you can actually upgrade it if you want so that won't be for this tutorial just because we are setting it up so you can actually upgrade it to any version you want to or anyone you want to so and um this is node and this web 3.js so web 3.js come um building with a um, truffle everything just come building with truffle so it and the rest so you don't need to install anything again um so for it for you to use solidity you can go through this tutorial so what we we'll just do is um let's just follow this um so he said in to initial that is a project so i think they have a boilerplate already called um pet shop so let's quickly let's do something similar to see what is inside what truffle will do for us what truffle can do for us so ls um i think i have meta coin here so meta coins another project entirely so ls so let me just see mk da mk da pet shop pet shop 
pet shop so cd pet shop pet shop um it's supposed to be a dash here and ls so you can see um pet shop is empty is an empty um directory so let's quickly unbox a truffle project so they have created a truffle um box just for the uh, tutorial so you can just use it so let's unbox the truffle pet shop yeah they also have meta coin you can unbox the meta coin that's if you want oh, but if you want a beer pro, uh, bull project you can use truffle in it too so once you read through the um uh, documentation you, you will know how to use it but we're just testing it out here so it, if it's going to work so it should be so truffle unbox pet shop um let's see yeah. so i think it will bring out some errors but you can ignore that so you have to ignore that um i think that's installation of some some certain things in uh the pet shop certain dependencies so you can just ignore that for now so let's wait for it to install so you can see preparing to dial to download box to download the box and unbox it for us yeah um we have to wait for that take time take time take time yeah i can see it she's streaming some issues here but i will ignore that for now um i'm not sure if he's going to do that for others so you can just see ls and you can see already there are some um files in in your page shop so let me open it with my code editor so code dot yeah so when I say code dot, it's, I think it will open my yeah. Yeah, so this is what Truffle does for us. It creates a uh the project, the boiler plate for us and so we can just continue editing. So you can see here we have the GitHub, um the contracts, yeah, this is our contract, the migration dot SOL, and we all know that um solidity uh, ends with um dot SOL. Yeah so we also have the migrations yeah and uh, we have the src so that's the the front end the added for it yeah this is so you can go through this if you want to continue with the tutorial you can continue after the um if you want to continue with the tutorial you can continue after the video but we're not going to dive deep into it so you can just read up more about trough and how to use it so you can see it's also as test and um some images too that we can use yeah some images too so i think that's all now um while writing smart contracts so let me try something here so while writing smart contracts you know you have to say contracts right so you have to say contracts then give it a name i think uh let me just see new and just trying this so you can see so while writing smart contract i think my my extension is not actually working fine yet anyways i can just cancel that so while writing smart contract in vs could provide a, an extension called solidity so you can actually install that so, so solidity once you search for it you get it so solidity i have it installed in my system or my ps code already so you can install the first one with i think for 63,000 downloads yeah with 14 star rating um 14 rating yeah with, yeah so you have to install it to make your work easier so let me undo what i did here you see yeah so you can actually specify this with your version of um solidity so it, the version this video was i think i think version 0.5.16 so you can actually specify it for that that's the one to uh that's all for that so that's all for that and the last thing we need to install is called ganachi yeah ganachi so this is Ganachi. So one click 
uh, so we can deploy our smart contract locally and use it. So you can see it. So this is a uh, Ganache, and you can read more about it. So you can just go to the tutorial. Tutorial. Yeah, so this is the text about Ganachi explaining what Ganachi does. I think so. I think so. So, not sure. Oh, so this is not Ganachi. So, let me just type. Ganache. and I think Ganache just type in Ganache download. Download. So click on um, and actually quick start out link with this once again. So you can see Ganachi quick start. Yeah, the documentation. So you can just download Ganachi, I think so. Yeah. See so this is you can click on download the appropriate version. So click on download. So you can just download it. Yeah, from this place or you can scroll it or you can download the file. So after downloading, uh, I think there's something like this. So let me just my download. I'll it uh, installed. So you can see Ganache. So you can just double click or run. So the issue you might be facing is that it might not work in your, it might not open. So you can just go to the properties. In the properties and um, permissions. So yeah, the properties, permissions. I think, yeah, allow executing file. So my Ganache is open. So let me just go back to where, where I was seeing before. Yeah, so you can see execute. So allow executing files as program. So I'm very sure a lot of users will get that um, issue of not opening, like Ganache unable to open. So you can just head to the properties, the permission, and execute. So allow executing files as program. So you have to allow it as program. Click on that, check, just check it. Yeah, so it's going to open and um, this can actually so let me just click on quick start is from click on the start it's going to take a while to just open i think it's time for me to just close all this close this um i think close this too yeah so this is it you can read more about it and everything is all set up for you all the packages are set up installed and um, you, you just need to continue with what you're doing start creating your smart contract take lessons on how to create smart contracts then you use it so now you are all set up to create smart contract locally without using remix so this will be the end of the tutorial if you like my video you can subscribe to my channel and also if you want tutorials on blockchain on how to create smart contracts uh, using moralis and the rest uh, subscribe to my channel thank you and um, bye